This is how I set up a breeding enclosure for some of my rarest anoles. I don't use soil. I actually don't use soil in any of my breeding enclosures. I only use sphagnum moss, and you'll see why in a little. These are large lizards. They're in the crown giant category. So they like large branches because they live high in the trees and naturally with large branches come large plants. So we're gonna add a large umbrella plant with a large pot of soil. The soil is where the female will hopefully lay her eggs. She won't lay her eggs in the sphagnum, she'll lay in the soil. This way I can dig through the one pot rather than the entire enclosure. It really eliminates the guessing. We add some more plants for cover and we introduce the giant blue beauty anoles. This male is completely fired up and this female is completely fired down. They can change their colors within only a few seconds and it's pretty crazy. Now this male's obviously pretty happy right now. Hopefully the female comes around and enjoys the enclosure. Once they're completely happy, they'll lay eggs. I'll dig in the pot and find them.